The temperatures around the area this morning were in the mid to upper 30s of 40 in Racine. Temperatures or wind chill temperatures dropped into the mid to upper 20s. More and more boats starting to fill the slips in the Port Washington Marina. Not that you want to use it today. When temperatures are in the low to mid 40s, 44 is the temperature. The sun has felt great this morning if you were out of the wind, but the clouds now moving in, so we're losing that. Go figure. Northeast wind at 15 to 30, making it feel even cooler. So the clouds have begun the return to the region, and that's with the cloudiness, or the rain showers, I should say, back off to the southwest. It is all rotating counterclockwise around this low-pressure system, so it's going to take its time getting here, but you notice that it is beginning to develop more into Illinois, and we'll be moving in here later this afternoon into the early evening. After those temperatures in the 30s this morning, not a big warm-up. It's only 43 in Shorewood, 46 in Tosa, as well as Franklin. Oak Creek's at 45, and those winds are whipping around anywhere from 15 to 30 miles per hour around southeastern Wisconsin, and as we mentioned earlier, Earlier. That is still creating some wind chills along the lakefront in the upper 30s. It feels like 36 in Waukesha and where temperatures are in the 50s, barely in the 50s. The wind chill, not much to talk about, but still that wind is cold. So we're going to have the clouds moving in this afternoon. Uh, so increasing clouds as we speak. 47 degrees for the temperature. Northeast wind at 15 to 25, making it feel even colder than that. Inland areas will get into the lower 50s. Here's the future forecast. With those clouds, eventually will come rain, and there will be some downpours overnight tonight with northeast winds still anywhere from 10 to 15, gusting to 20. And so that's going to make upper 30s and rainy conditions feel even worse by tomorrow morning. Then we'll continue to have these very hit and miss rain showers throughout the afternoon tomorrow, but the ground's already going to be pretty wet. The clouds will stick around and it is going to be breezy. How much rain are we talking about? Possibly about a half to three quarters of an inch of rain across most of southeastern Wisconsin. So it's going to be a good soaking rain, but the temperatures are not going to help. Look at the, I mean, at least it's going to be warm enough that it's not going to snow. Barely. We're talking upper 30s with wind chills in the upper 20s. And then for tomorrow afternoon, these are your highs. Low to maybe mid 40s. And with northeast winds at 15 to 20, wind chills all day in the 30s. It is not going to be a pleasant night or day tomorrow. I'm full of great news. 51 on Friday, the sun returns. Just a few pop-up showers both Saturday and Sunday. Otherwise, you're going to see plenty of sunshine. Still cool with highs in the lower 50s. And we start to warm back up into the 60s by next Tuesday and all of next week, which will be fine with me. This cold <laughs> is miserable. <laughs> Looks pretty good. Thanks, Brian.